I was on Star Search the year that Kevin James competed. I can't remember now if he even won or not, but I remember giving him a ride somewhere and um, it was pretty cool. But I'll, let me tell you the insight that that gave me. When you watch America's Got Talent or you watch, um, you know, American Idol or any of these competition shows and you're watching as an audience mem member and you see who wins and who loses, and you're like, oh yeah, I like that person. I didn't like that person. Standing there when somebody, when it's announced who wins and who loses, Oh my God, it's such an emotional moment. It's, 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 you, you really see, oh my gosh, this is real. And I've got five people over here who are like devastated and you can feel that. And five people over here who are elated and it's like, oh my gosh, I'm sorry, you guys. And congratulations, you guys. It's really an interesting phenomenon. Who was it? Was it Ellen DeGeneres on American Idol or Britney or somebody who said, I, I just can't do it anymore. I it's too hard. I can't do it. And I can understand that it, it is, it's devastating, you know, when you feel that emotion. So yeah, that gave me a lot of insight into those shows. What, what was it like working with Ed McMahon? He was awesome. He was, you know, a true pro. He was just awesome. And you know, hey, oh, all of that was real. And that was really who he was. And I was just aware every second that, you know, wow, this is amazing. I'm, I'm working with an icon.